Okay, so good morning vlog. Um, today is Friday, January 12th. And let me just tell you how I started off my morning. So I had started back going to therapy. And so I thought my therapy session was at 9 a.m. because it was at 9 a.m. last week. And so I'm thinking it's at 9 a.m. Whole time it's at 8 a.m. So I didn't wake up until like 8.30. And then I started panicking because I'm like, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Um, I miss therapy. And so I'm trying to email my therapist to let her know, you know, what's going on. My Gmail not working. So for the past, like, few months, like, it has been saying that, like, I was out of storage. Um, blah, blah, blah. I ain't paid no mind, right? So... I guess today today it ran out of storage and I couldn't send no emails. I wasn't receiving emails, nothing, none of that. So I'm just like, oh my gosh. So I tried sending her an email from my other account. Um, that went through because it's no storage issues, but I guess maybe like she didn't respond because I mean that's not the email that I have on the account. So, anyways. I had to go through this long thing because I had Google Photos. That was that what was taking up all the storage on my account was Google Photos. I don't even use Google Photos no more. Like, I used it to like try to get out of paying Apple for more storage, but I ended up just paying Apple because it's just more convenient. I'd rather have this stuff on my phone than to go through an app, blah, blah, blah. So, long story short, it took me about 10 minutes to sit there and actually go through all those photos. If you know me, I have like, let me just, I'm not even gonna tell you a lie. I'm gonna tell you how many photos I have on my phone right now. I have 87,000 photos, videos on my phone right now, 87,000. So my Google photos probably took like half of that because at a point, a certain point I stopped backing it up because I was just like, it's just too much for me to have to back it up and do all of that. So long story short, I had to delete like probably like 40,000 pictures, videos, all of that off of Google Photos. So, with that being said, I've missed therapy. Um, I fixed my, I fixed my Gmail account, okay? So, storage is not an issue anymore. Um, and today's Friday. So, we just gonna, we just gonna go through have a good weekend, you know. So it is a long weekend because Martin Luther King Day is on Monday, so we don't have school. Um, so I just want to do this vlog to show you a more in-depth weekend vlog. I was supposed to do one last semester. I never, I ended up like never editing it. That's my problem with YouTube. I got another video I had to edit um, for the new year. It's when I came back home never edited it so this weekend since i don't have school on monday i have like a little more free time i work on editing that last video from last week um showing you guys what i have to do the reading i have to do because i have a ton of reading like a ton um this was really like the first week back um so I think the reading was a little more chill, um, if you can say chill in law school. Um, but yeah, next week is really amped up, so it's I'm gonna really have to pace myself because I'm not trying to. Number one, I'm not trying to do anything on Martin Luther King Day. I just want to relax. I just want to take that day off. So that's my goal. So I'm gonna work, grind hard now, so I can have that time off, and then yeah. Right now, I'm ordering some stuff off the Instacart. Um, my mom lets me use her card, so gotta get some groceries off the of Instacart. And then after that, I'm going to tidy up the house real quick. I got some dishes I need to do. And then, I'm trying to think what else. Later, I have a meeting for my research assistant position. And then after that, I'm helping out at the open house at Central. Um, and like, I don't know, it's kind of crazy. Like, so I had posted like a first day back 
not first day back, but like my reading for the first day of school on TikTok. Again, if you're not following me on TikTok, go follow me on TikTok at Tavaria Leanne. Um, but anyways, so I posted that video, like just my reading for that one day of class. Cause I only had class on that Thursday that week. So I have been getting comments, like people saying like, oh, I'm going to be there on Friday. I'm going, I'm going to the open house. And like people are like, oh, this is crazy. This came up on my timeline. My son is going, it's on the way up there. Like, so I just, you know, I just find it like crazy that it's like full circle. Like, um, people really be like watching my content. Like, I really love that. Um, because that's why I make it. Like, I just wanted more people to see, uh, people that look like them, um, who talk like them, who or who's not at like an Ivy League school. Cause I'm not at an Ivy League school. Um, you know, I just kind of like wanted to show somebody like regular. So yeah, I just find it like when y'all post those comments, it's like, um, I'm really getting my point across. So I love that. Thank you. Um, so anyway, that's enough talking. That's how my morning is going. We're going to make the day better. It's okay. Cause like I said, it's Friday. Um, but I'm going to go ahead, order these groceries, um, shower, get ready, walk my dog, do all of that good stuff. And I will talk to you guys soon. Okay. So I just showered and everything I have on my NCCU legal equal shirt with just like some tights on. Um, but I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this head. So I saw, like I was looking for like, you know, some hairstyles on TikTok, like for like your real hair um, or natural hair. I don't know, okay. So I don't know if you're supposed to say natural hair or real hair because I'm not natural, so like I'm mean, like I don't know if I should say natural hair because I feel like if I say natural hair I'm gonna start seeing all this curly hair and stuff and I ain't got that. So anyways, I saw that um a cute like updo. It was like an updo with like like a bang like she like swooped her hair over and then like, she put like a little curly part and she curled a ponytail and I kind of want to try that but. I don't know how it's going to turn out because I'm going to be honest y'all like I also don't have like gel like I don't have like any type of gel or or um what's some things called I think it's like balm sticks wax sticks that's what it's called wax sticks so I don't have like anything to really make sure that my hair lays flat so we just gonna see how we look i might do like maybe like a messy version <laughs> like just call it like the messy version of it because yeah so i don't know if this is enough hair i don't know how she did it y'all okay because it was like it was like something like this like she had like swooped it like <laughs> oh my god i don't know how to do hair for real like i do not know how to do hair um so yeah it was like a swoop like this like she kind of like swooped it oh, you know i just realized i ain't got no bobby pins so how would it stay so like it was something like this and like her hair was up that don't look bad but i just thought about it i don't have no bobby pins like when I say I don't do my I don't do hair like I do not do hair like I really mean it when I say I don't do hair I don't do hair so I might be able to find like one body pin in here I'm gonna look but we gonna try this out we gonna try this out and we gonna see how this go. Um, I'm scared because, like I said, I don't know how to do here, y'all. We gonna we gonna see how it go. Okay, so be back. Okay, so I think this 
is the final look i know it's not like perfect because again y'all i don't know how to do hair for real so i just really tried something um i think the next time i do it it'll look better but i feel like this is kind of like this is cute enough for today i'll say that like this is cute enough for today so like, i just did like some curls at the end and i was really struggling on this part like i cannot get this part for life for me like but we just gonna leave it like this. We just gonna leave it alone. We just gonna leave it like this. So I'm still waiting on Instacart. They still have not came. So I'm gonna start cleaning up now. Sup vlog. So I am back at home. Well, I've been at home for like a little minute. I got back at like 4.30, but um, I was not able to like vlog the open house. Like I was just, man, if you saw me at this school, I was just running around like the chicken with his head cut off. Like I just had so many things going on at once because I had a meeting at one, then open house was like two to four. But I would say I think it went very well. I gave my first tour um, because I do serve as one of the admissions, what's it called? I think like admissions rep or something like that. Basically, I just help out with admissions on, from here to there. Anyway, so today was my first tour to like a group and I think it went really well. At least I hope it did. Um, I asked the students, well like the prospective students, I was like, what did you think? They was like, it was really good. You helped me out a lot. You were very um, knowledgeable. So I think it went well. So then when I got back, um, I had to do a sworn statement for somebody for my internship that's about to end. And y'all, it is just so much like my supervisor is just, y'all, I understand because it's like the deadline is tomorrow. So like he probably like panicking himself, but it's like, Lord have mercy. Like don't put that panic out on me. So I did that. I just made me some butter chicken. I'm finna eat that. And then honestly, the rest of the night, I might just drink me some wine and do some work because like I said, I'm gonna show y'all my to-do list and I'm gonna show you what I've got done so far. So it's just like a lot of reading, but like I said, I really, really just want to take Monday off. Just be that like, just a relaxed day. Like it's the holiday, let me treat it so. so I'm just really gonna knock some work out tonight. Um, it also just started raining. Like, I don't know what's going on with North Carolina, but I am sick of the rain. Like, it was literally just a storm the other day. Like, they literally sent us home, okay? Cause it was talking about like level two or three tornado watch and flood watch and all this other stuff, right? So I'm like, What's going with like what's going on with all this bad weather? Like, come on now. Um, but yeah, again, it was just really cool. I met like I think it was like two girls that was from Georgia. They were from Atlanta. Um because I'm like, you know, who's really coming from Athens? But yeah, they were from Atlanta. I met two girls from Atlanta. Other people were like from one girl was from like Maryland, another girl was from like Virginia, one girl from Tennessee, but I just loved hearing how Central was their first choice. I really love that. Um, and like one girl asked me about competitiveness and I like went on a whole spiel, y'all. I went on a whole spiel. And I was like, you know, I am a little biased cause this is the school I go to, but like honestly, and I mean this like from the bottom of my heart, I have not felt like competitiveness like exists at Central. Like, yes, everybody wants to get good grades. Everybody wants to be at the top of their class. Yes, but there's no like hiding the hand. Like people are so willing to like share their outlines and you know, their notes and you know, just everybody just like, it's so helpful to like share anything that they have, the knowledge from their head, the knowledge in their in they computer, like they are willing to share it. And I love that about Central. Um, so yeah, I was just, 
making my food though and I tried to like tidy up this kitchen a little bit so I loaded up my dishwasher but I'm not gonna start that until after I get done eating my food so I can be done with dishes um because honestly y'all that was like one of my goals was like to like because I have a habit like I will leave dishes in the sink like you know, some people, they were raised like, you not leaving no dishes in the sink. Like, I be leaving dishes in the sink. And sometimes it's ridiculous, because it's like, it's just me. Like, where are all these dishes coming from? It's just me. And so, I started off, like, when I came back from Georgia, um, last week, I think, I was doing, I was doing a really good job of like making sure the kitchen was clean before I went to sleep. And since school started back, I just been slacking. But I think what I need to do is just take time, like make that part of my unwinding or like before I take a shower, just go ahead and clean the kitchen because sometimes it just gets so overwhelming and I'm just like, where did all these dishes come from? And I got a dishwasher, I'ma use it. You know, some people got dishwashers and don't use them. I'ma use mine. Okay, I, I'm not washing all them dishes by hand. It's a few dishes that I can't put in there. But um, besides that, if I can put it in there, I'm gonna put it in the dishwasher. Like, I'm gonna let the dishwasher do the washing the dishes for me, okay? Um, so I just loaded it up. I'm gonna wait till I get done eating to like start it. But yeah, my kitchen is like looking a lot better just by loading the dishwasher. So you're gonna get a little bit better about that. But yeah, I feel like at this point, I'm kind of ranting a little bit. So I'm going to shut up and eat my food because I'm starving, okay? So. Early baby lady, you can show me things. You know what it is, I know I visit. When you see, did I see? No, no, no. Baby, breathe, wait to go, so hold me tight. Well, I see you at the show tonight. So y'all, this is my to-do list. Um, I have to read chapter one of the textbook for my MPA. This is basically it. Sorry y'all, I'm zoomed in so y'all can see the to-do list. But this is the book for my MPA, chapter one. I don't know how many pages that is. Cause I've not looked yet. But this focus, okay. For con law, not much. And the only reason it's not much is because we're behind. So I pretty much did the reading, like the schedule reading for last week. I've already done that, but we didn't finish it. So I'm only going to read these few pages because I don't think, honestly, I don't even know if we're going to finish what we started on Thursday because it was still a lot of cases left. So for now, I'm going to do this. If I get done by like Saturday with all my other readings, then I'll go ahead and do start reading the rest. But for right now, I'm just doing this. Evidence, I did chapters 8. I did chapter 7 before class. I did chapter 8 and 9 last night. And so, I just got to do chapter 10 and then the quizzes for that. But I didn't put the quizzes on there because I'm just going to do that probably Sunday. Uh, Crim Pro, I need to read about, what is that, like 30 pages, roughly. A little bit more than 30 pages, of course, but like, I'm just gonna say around 30 pages. That's what I'm gonna focus on tonight. My discussion form, I will do that tomorrow. This is also for my MPA. This is Nelson Mandela's uh, biography, The Long Walk to Freedom. But that's like 59 pages, but like, it's like... It's not like a law textbook. Like it's not like a cases. Like it's not cases. So I'm not really worried about that. I can just like read that in one sitting. And I really believe I read this in middle school. So this might just be like a refresher. I could have sworn I read this in middle school. Like I really think I read this in middle school. So yeah, I'm not really worried about this one. I might just read this in bed tonight and be done. It's just, let me make sure this focus. It's really just going to be Crim Pro evidence. I think I'm going to focus on those two tonight. If I get done with those two, then I'll do basically my MPA stuff tomorrow. 
and study tomorrow. Uh, I'm thinking about going to a coffee shop, so we'll see how that goes. But right now, it is 6.52. Let's see what time I can get done with Evidence and Crim Pro. Hey. Truck to the plane, to the truck, truck to the hotel lobby. Me, I go through underground garages, presidential suite on deposit, elevator up to the room, shower up, and then we hit the club. Touchdown, gotta see what's up. Area code in my phone, what numbers do I still have? Who do I know from the past? Hit one, she say she got a man. Hit another one, it goes green. Must have changed foes on the team. Remember when you let me in between? That was 2017, all good. Each other look around, find one to see my type. Damn, my dog, and he know what I like. He done found me plenty in my life. Problem Good morning, vlog. Today is January 13th. It is 8 14 in the morning. And y'all, I just got to the coffee shop because I said I want to work at a coffee shop today, but it looks like it's packed inside. And so. I had this thing where like I like to get to the coffee shop like as soon as they open because I don't know like I like to make sure that I get a seat and I don't like people looking at me you know like getting to my seat and putting my stuff down and doing all of that so I don't, maybe it's just me maybe it's just an anxious thing anxiety thing but yeah I'm looking in the coffee shop and I'm like I don't see any spots like it looks full in there and so i'm really debating if i want to go in like y'all y'all might think it's like crazy but like i don't know it's just something about me like it's just one seat that i like when i come here i always get that seat like at the end of the coffee shop and so i just see a whole bunch of people and i'm like man why are y'all in here like it's it's 8 15 like i was i got here only like 13 minutes late and already packed so what i think i'm gonna do is just go in here order some food and scope the scenery i'll take my bag and like i'll decide if i can bring my book bag back because i don't know they do have some good breakfast like they have like waffle smash sandwiches or something like that and it's really good so i'm gonna see and it looks like two people just walked out who were like sitting down maybe i don't know <laughs> i don't know y'all i'm really contemplating i feel like i should just go in and see i feel like i should go in and see i'm just trying to like why is it packed already it literally just opened and it's already packed like what like somebody just help me understand like unless you're a student or you work remote and most people who be working remote at coffee shops that's monday through friday if it's a saturday sunday and you're at a coffee shop at 8 a.m and you're not a student why like some people be coming in there like they just be like they literally grab a coffee they be with their friends i guess and they just like be chatting it up like they just be talking Y'all couldn't, I mean, like, uh, I mean, cool, you want to grab some coffee, but, like, you couldn't get that later in the day? Like, why are you up chatting with your friends at 8 a.m.? I don't understand it. If you're not a student, why are you up at a coffee shop chatting at 8 a.m.? Somebody please help me understand, because I don't understand. Um, But, y'all, I'll let y'all know what I do, or y'all will see what I do. So, peace. Hey y'all, so let me make sure this is down. I'm back from the coffee shop. Um, it is currently 12.03, so I was pretty much, you might as well just say I was here at eight. Okay, yeah, I was a little late, but you might as well say I was here at eight. So I just did about four hours of straight work. I knocked out so much work. I finished um, my criminal procedure reading. I did evidence. I started the Nelson Mandela book. I'm halfway done with what I got to read for that. Um, what else did I do? I did a chapter quiz for evidence. 
and I did some work for my internship. So right now I'm about to go home because I did order a breakfast sandwich, but y'all when i say i was locked in i was really like locked in so i was really just drinking my coffee and oftentimes like i will get breakfast like my breakfast for me looks like coffee and some type of food to go with it right so most times i usually get full out the coffee like i'll start drinking the coffee and then it's like i don't even want the food anymore so Pretty much that's what happened today. I was drinking my coffee, I was locked in my work, and I didn't even eat my sandwich, so I got it to go. I'm gonna go home, warm it up, and eat that because it usually be good, like warmed up, so that's fine. Um, and then take like a little break, and I think I'm gonna start back doing work maybe like 2 p.m. Um, I think the only thing left I have to do is constitutional law reading, but again, I already told y'all, we a little behind in that class, so it's just a little bit of reading for that. Um, I have like two more chapter quizzes to do for evidence. Um, they're not really long. I told one of my coworkers for the internship um, that I would do something for her for work. You know, I'm getting paid, so yeah, if I can help out, I'll do it so I can get me some more hours. So I'm gonna do that, and then I think that's it and so what i'll probably do is once i'm done with all my work for real for real i'll probably just start studying um evidence i took that like i said i took one of the quizzes and i was like oh i thought i kind of like knew this but i need to really go ahead and start working on like my, my understanding now and then for evidence i need to go ahead and start doing my flashcards because it's a bunch of rules and like you know you have to know like the exclusions and you know not exclusions the exceptions and everything like that so i just want to go ahead and start working on that because yes i don't have midterms until like probably end of february early march but y'all this semester i really want to get on dean's list like i really just want to like have nothing but a's and b's so yeah your girl is gonna you know do the work bust my butt off like do what i gotta do because last semester I had A's and B's. I, I just had one C, um, and that was business associations. But I was really like, I was like, this close, y'all. I was like, this close. So I was like, this close. And so I'm just like, this semester, I'm gonna, I'm gonna grind, do what I gotta do, because I really want Dean's List. So we're gonna make that happen. But yeah, that's pretty much how my morning has went. I'm sorry I didn't record. Um, it was just like a lot going on in here and I don't like drawing attention to my, I don't like drawing attention to myself. So yeah, I'm gonna see y'all when I get home. So I'm back at home, but this is the sandwich I began. Like you see how it's called smash waffles. This is, I think the chicken go clucky or something like this. Cause it's chicken, cheese, bacon. And then it's like the bread, it's like two waffles. But it's so good. So I'm about to eat this. I just warmed it up. I'm about to eat this. And um, just take me a quick little break. Okay, so break is over. Well, like my break been over, but I had started editing um, that video I was talking about that I did last week, but I never edited. I started on that. That is like halfway finished. But now I'm about to start, like I said, my um, coworker had reached out to me needing help with the application because the deadline is due at 11.59. So everybody is like pretty much on crunch mode trying to get the applications in. So I'm helping a few of them at this point just put the information onto the platform. So... That's what I'm about to do. And then once I'm done with this, I will, um, that's when I will finish doing my other assignments. But like I said, I did so much at the coffee shop. I'm not really worried. Um, because if I don't finish it today, well, like, I can finish the other two assignments and then make tomorrow just my like strictly study day, flashcards, all of that. I think I need to go to, I need to check to see if I got some flashcards. I'm gonna check first. 
but if not i might have to go buy dollar tree and get some flashcards. um but yeah i'm just gonna work on this and that'll be it i can't show y'all like my screen because it's personal people's like personal information and stuff but yeah you're just gonna see me doing work y'all these folks got me working like working working so it's 6 16. y'all know how i said earlier like it was like three i said that i was finna do so i'm finna help my co-worker and it was just like one application y'all another co-worker said she need three done then another co-worker she said she need two done so then my supervisor he just went ahead and asked he was like can you work late so yeah it looks like i'm gonna be finishing up my to-do list tomorrow you know i thought i was gonna finish it today and just study tomorrow but if I need to work a little more, make that money. I'll make that money, get me a nice little check at the end of the month, okay? Um, but yeah, I just didn't know that I was gonna be working this long. Like, really did not know that. Like, I've been done my stuff. But, um, like I said, the, app, the deadline is 11.59. So, think of it like a school assignment. Like, it's, it's times 10 though, because it's so many farmers that we're trying to help. So it's like so many applications that got to get done. And like, it's just so freaking tedious. Like, it's annoying. But we're going to get it done. We're going to see what time I get done. I think these going to be my last two. Because after that, baby, I'm not doing no more. I done did probably like, this is going to make six. Like with these two that I do, this gonna be like six. Mind you, they take like about a good 45 minutes each, maybe an hour each because it's just so much information. And then like, if I go to somebody's application that they've done in like the Google Drive, if I go to that and it's still like questions that's not answered, I still have to take that person and see like, hey, what do you want me to put for this answer? And it makes the process a little longer because I'm like, I gotta wait on them to respond, blah, blah, blah. So yeah, it's just, it's just a lot. I think if I get done in time, I think I deserve a little treat. So I might go to Tarje, you know, get a little treat because I got paid. <laughs> I got paid, but I can't do too much now. We got bills to pay, We got bills to pay. Okay. So I just wanted to update you guys because I've been in my for a little minute. Like it's it's nighttime now. Like it's dark outside now. That's how long I've been sitting at my computer doing these applications. So with that being said, let me try to go ahead and knock out these last two. And if I'm done by eight, I will go get me a little treat. Maybe like some ice cream, Tarjay run. I don't know. We'll see. I'll keep you guys posted. Peace. Metro. Yo, Metro. I feel like I'm with a lesbian. Can I knock on your double if it let me in? I should have learned my lesson then. I didn't want to keep. So I went to Target. So like, let me tell y'all, the website, I guess crashed and was like not working. So I took it upon myself to go ahead and go to Target. Um, I just got like some razors, some shave cream. I got some shampoo, cause my dandruff has been acting up. We gonna see if this helps. And then I found these like in the deal section, but I thought this might be good for like overnight oats. And I saw a recipe, I forget what it's called. I think it's like, it's something to do with chia seeds. I wanted to try that. I think it's like chia pudding. Um, and then I grabbed some wine for tonight. And I found these cute little plates on sale. And I just thought this was like so cute for like Valentine's. I don't even know. 
I just thought it was cute. Like, it's a little heart shape, like, to die for. And then, like I said, I was gonna treat myself, so I got kava. And now I'm just about to like chill and probably like watch a show, maybe a movie. But honestly, y'all, I'm tired. I'm ready to go to bed and I'm going to church in the morning. And I like to go to the 9 a.m. service. So I need to go ahead and go to bed. No, I didn't finish all my work, but y'all saw that I was doing like my internship work all day like my supervisor really gone texas he was like stay up like don't go to sleep because the website was not working me i did my part i helped out some of my co-workers i did like i think i did like six applications that were not mine like it was theirs but you know just to help them out so i believe i did my part i'm gonna go to bed okay sir don't text me. I didn't need my job, okay? So, yeah. I will see you guys later. Peace. Uh, good morning vlog. Today is January 14th. I just got out of the shower. I have not did my hair yet. As you can see, I just ripped the bonnet off. Um, I was supposed to go to church at 9 a.m., but it's a lazy morning, so I'm just gonna go to the 1045 service. So I'm about to make breakfast real quick. Um, walk Taylor and then go to church. I mean, today I don't really have much to do because like I said, I knocked out a lot of my schoolwork yesterday. I think it's like two more things I have to do. I'm gonna spend the rest of the day studying and editing my, um, my other vlog. But yeah, let me just go ahead and make my breakfast. When this cat nigga can't even see me on wins She fought a flight nigga when this cat She fought a flight when I'm way out of here She fought a flight nigga can't even see me on way out of here I'm too far in the sky Hermes ash for the dark my ash Bitch so pretty look better than Cassie Puffin' on Zooters and she callin' me daddy Walkin' on shit turn it up and I guess Came out the car and ain't never me to swaggin' Secure the bag out of bitch I'm a beggin' Turnin' it up gotta make sure she good Parkin' two million in the middle of my hood Nigga, no mud, I made out of the sword. Pro hard and sense me, do that one good. Out of these niggas, they lookin' the same. They copy my lingo, they bite in my chain. Championship, championship, ain't just gon' empty. She bitch breakin' niggas, they lookin' the key. Heard it, I found them, I'm makin' the counter, though. Bring me this money like they from religion. This could be a man, they're sad, they're vanity. Nigga, they try to compare with whatever I did. Them that touched on hundreds of this. Okay, so it's 1032. I don't know if y'all can see. Oh. This is pretty much my fit. Um, it's a like non, what's it called? Non-dominational, non, something like that. I can't say the word, but that's the type of church I go to and they don't really care how you dress. So I usually just be wearing like some jeans with no holes and a shirt and some Converse's and call it a day. Um, it's like eight to 10 minutes away, so I should get there like right on time. But this is basically the fit. Like I said, I need to do my hair, I need to wash it tonight because it looks a mess. But I will see you guys after church. Bye. Y'all, how you did that? Check out lift up when you take off, how you did that? You put switches up on your blinkers, how you did that? Your LV bed turned to a legend, how you did that?
Hey y'all, so as you can see, I've been back from church. It was a really good service. Um, I started up cleaning, but I realized I needed some Tide Pods, some more Tide Pods. I was gonna eventually run out and I got like a bunch of other loads I need to do since I'm washing my sheets and covers today. Um, so I need some Tide Pods, some scented beads. Uh, then I'm gonna run to Trader Joe's cause tonight I'm gonna do like the little salmon bites and rice and i love their jasmine rice so i'm gonna pick that up and i'm trying to hurry up before the covers get done but i needed to stop by the leasing office real quick because i have a package in there so i just want to update you guys because i'm like y'all gonna see that i clearly got back from church and like i didn't put no background on like what i was doing so i just wanted to tell y'all so anyways let me run these errands and I will see you guys later. Bye. So I'm back from running my errands, but I got Zaxby's as a quick little lunch. Cause again, I'm a cook tonight, but tell me why I'm getting the groceries out the back of the car. I wasted my whole tea. Like tea is just gone. Um, I'm a little salty about that. Cause that tea was busting too. And I got a medium. But I guess I'll just drink this tea and lemonade from Trader Joe's. It's so good. It's a little Arnold Palmer. Um, and I got the rice for my salmon tonight. So this comes with like three bags in it. So I just bought two of those because it was like $4. Um, but I love their jasmine rice and you could just pop it in the microwave and cook it for like three minutes and it's good to go. I got some more butter chicken. I got some more shrimp. Boom ba. And then I got some paper towels and some toilet tissue. Cause Trader Joe's I can get 12 rolls of toilet tissue for like $3.99. Then from Walmart, I got the toilet wine cleaners. I got some more Tide Pods because I only got one left. And then like I said, I needed more scented beads for the rest of my clothes. And that was it. That was my run, my little errands. So I'm gonna put this stuff in the freezer real quick. And then I'm gonna go ahead and eat my food and then I'll finish cleaning up. So. Delivered the other package that I was talking about, so I just ran to get that because they had it outside of the like leasing office, like they had it outside. So I saw that I was like, let me go ahead and get my package. Like they just, I don't know. Sometimes they don't become, they don't be bringing the package in. Like they'll just leave it outside. Like what? And so. Really like nothing. Like I got why is it all messed up? 
so I got Taylor this little toy. Like it's supposed to be like an interact. Y'all, she done ran over here. But it's supposed to be like an interactive dog toy. So I was like trying to find something that's gonna like engage her mind, stimulate her mind, um, and keep her busy. And so I think I'm supposed to put like treats in here. I think. Or no. It just says makes fun giggle sounds when it moves around. I don't know, we gonna see. So I thought she put treats in it, but like giggle sounds, she might drive me crazy with this y'all, I don't know. Let's see. Okay, don't mind the clothes back there. That's the next load. Okay, look, she is ready. She is ready. Why she whining? She had like she confused. I don't know if she like it, y'all. Do you like it? Yes or no? I don't think she, I don't think she like it, y'all. Y'all, why did she go to her crate? Um, anyways. And then I got one of those like, you know the thing, you know how like when you wash your face and the water be like dripping down I cannot stand that. And so I saw that people had these. I was like, I need to get one because this this just gonna change the skincare. Like no water coming down. What? No, I did not need this, but it was like three dollars. So why not? Um, but basically that was it. Um so yeah, I'm gonna finish cleaning. I just had to go grab that real quick and show y'all what I had got, so. Okay, so it is 4.39. I am officially done cleaning the house. As you can see, it looks so much better in here. It looks so good. Say hi. So yeah, I'm done cleaning. I'm about to finish up my reading for um, Nelson Mandela's book. I had to read the page 59. Where did I stop off? Yesterday, I stopped at page 25. So a little over halfway to go. And then I have two more quizzes to do for evidence. And I think that's it. And then after that, I think what I wanna do is, oh yeah, I gotta wash my hair tonight. So that's another thing. So I gotta cook, wash my hair. It's just a lot, y'all, <laughs> goodness gracious. But I think after that, I just wanna go over Quimby. Sorry y'all, that's my um, little shark robot thing, the vacuum cleaner thingy.
And so, for you, for people that like don't know what Quimby is, Quimby is basically like this program or like this website. So like you can find cases on here, like case briefs. They have videos on here. And then they also have like their own little courses. So they have like civil procedure, constitutional law contracts. They have all like the law school courses and stuff. And it's like videos for each one. And um, I like the videos. They be like pretty concise. I think most of them are like maybe seven, eight minutes. It's just another way to supplement your reading or like your learning in class. Um, so I like to use this and Themis, but today I'm just gonna go through Quimby for criminal procedure. Um, just to kind of like make sure that I understand what we've learned so far, which isn't a lot because it's only like last, like, I don't know, like last week was the first full first week mind you two l's and three l's we started on the third so this really was our second week but that was like two days right two days so this was our first full week like full week school week so it's not been a lot because if you count that in total that's been three classes so basically just three classes that i've had so far um, and I feel like we've covered a lot because again, they are 75 minute classes instead of just 50 minutes. So it's been a lot. It seems like it's not a lot, but it has been a lot, if that makes sense. And so again, my goal is I just want to like stay on top of like my studying and I don't want to wait until the last minute to start studying. I want to go ahead and make sure that I'm understanding the information as we're learning it. So with that being said i think i want to do all the subjects today just do like a refresher and what we learn because if you look i'm just gonna show y'all real quick hold on so if you look this is make sure that focuses okay so this is what a course looks like so this is like basically criminal procedure course on Quimby this is just like an introduction this just outlines the different uh, modules or whatever and so this is kind of like where we're at Fourth Amendment um, we've been going on research and seizures so I will probably watch one two three these three because we haven't really gotten into like warrants. We've really been focusing on whether, like what constitutes a search and what constitutes a seizure and all of that. And like really just like defining it like through the case books, like the cases and stuff. So one thing I like about Quimby is like after each video, you just like can quiz yourself. And I really like that because it's like, it helps me understand like, did I really understand what I just watched or not? Because, you know, if I do really well on the quiz, clearly I understood what was going on. If I do bad, then uh, I need to find another supplement maybe and go in deeper. So probably like watch these three. Again, if I can go like over here to courses. Let's see, um, evidence. Again, same thing admissibility character and habit so hmm. I feel like I'm gonna have to like really look at this because from what I'm looking at now I don't think that we went over this I think let me just look at one okay so just looking at this little picture from the start of the video it looks like something that we've talked about but what's getting me is like they're not really talking about the rules okay here we go here we go so like rule 401 through 403 we have went over that 105 i don't think um let me see i don't know if we went over 105 so i mean i think that kind of just shows like no supplement is ever going to be perfect and like fine tune 
Uh, let me back this up. There we go. So I think this kind of just shows that like supplements are not meant to replace like going to class and paying attention in class like by any means. It's meant to be in addition to what you learn in class and your readings because sometimes these supplements will talk about stuff that we are not going to talk about or we haven't gotten to yet and they like teach it a little bit earlier or like you know what I'm trying to say but basically it doesn't no supplement is is going to be like hand in hand with your class like it's not a replacement so anyways I say all this to say this is basically what I'm just gonna do until I start cooking uh, basically read and then watch videos take the quizzes and that's pretty much my schoolwork for today like I said I knocked out a lot yesterday so very proud of myself because I get to like relax just a little bit today um so anyways let me go ahead and get to work see you later I wanna tell you how I feel when I'm alone. Oh, I'll lay something down for you. I'll play a whole time for you. Spray the whole hundred round for you. Twisting all my fingers for my dog. You my treacherous little twin, and you know that we locked in. And I love you like my kin, it's whatever for you. I go up and down that road, I go anywhere you go. When you tell me life is good, I want better for you. Yeah. You my twin. My okay, so as y'all can see, I made some food. I made, sorry y'all, I made salmon bites. I was gonna say lemon bites. I made salmon bites with garlic and honey. I saw it on TikTok, so I just wanted to try it. Um, but I did record like a TikTok for it. Um, I'm about to watch TV and chill because y'all forgot I gotta do my hair. I said I was gonna do my hair today. So I think after I eat, I'm gonna go ahead and walk Taylor and then take a shower so I can do my hair. And um, pretty much it's gonna be like an everything shower. Y'all pray for me. But yeah, I'm very proud. Like it looks very like fancy. Look how I did the rice. Like, it looks so fancy. Um, but I'm gonna go ahead and eat and then I will see you guys later. Peace. Okay, so I took my shower, did my, well, pretty much did my everything shower. Um, did my hair. I just blow dried it. I'm gonna finish it tomorrow because I'm not going nowhere. So it's no point in doing anything to it tonight. But my hair is growing back so good like august of last year i like had a really good trim like a really good trim and um it's just growing back so good um but i'm about to clean up this kitchen and then go ahead and call it a night because y'all i am tired but that's pretty much what my weekend looked like um I'm not gonna show y'all Nick till um tomorrow. Like even though it's a long weekend, I'm not gonna show y'all that because like I said, I'm not doing no work. I'm just gonna relax. But this is kinda I just wanted to show y'all like what a weekend in a law student looked like. This is kinda like I'm not gonna say a chill weekend because I did a lot on Saturday with school and my internship so y'all got to see that and then today was pretty much like my sunday reset so grocery shopping laundry cleaning the house and studying um but i hope y'all enjoy the video please comment down below what you think what y'all want to see um or whatnot and enjoy your weekend or enjoy your week you know whenever you're watching bye